What's up, guys? Justin here, bringing you another poorly reviewed beer from Three Heads Brewing in Rochester, New York. This is Freddy D. Lager. Give you a nice long look at that label because uh, I could find zero information on this beer on the internet. Uh, there was, I could barely find proof of its existence on the Three Heads Brewing website. I eventually did find it uh, just on like a geographic find our beer uh, tool, but no information, no, it's not even listed in the, the our beer list under Three Heads website, and that just kind of seems to be a bit of an ongoing thing for me. Not that the beer industry needs to be providing information on my, for me, but I think it's, it's kind of a nice thing to have for consumers to get a little bit more informa information about the beer, either on the, the label, which there's nothing on the label, just the uh, the only writing is kind of all the uh, disclaimers, government warnings, and so forth. Uh, so you can have it on the on the bottle or a can or whatever, or have it on, on the website, just so people have some kind of an idea of what they're what they're drinking. All I can tell you is that it is 5.5% ABV and 26 IBU. And presumably it's made with hops and barley and things. Okay. Slightly hazy, nice uh Nice gold orange color. Kind of goes towards a, a str more straw gold as it holds up to the light. The, the core of it's still a, a nice orange color. This is somewhat hazy. I can definitely see my fingers through the far side of the glass, but there is some uh, occlusion there. Some blockage. Uh, not really seeing much in the way of uh, just very, very little carbonation as I hold up to the light. And just, what, about a finger's worth of head, maybe a little bit more. It's doing a fair job of hanging around. All right, now let's get to it. Hmm. Hmm. Impressive little hot bite for, for a lager. Uh, nice maltiness as well. A really neat and a really neat uh, <coughs> excuse me, a neat blend and balance of the two actually. The malts lead off, and there's almost kind of a caramel note going on, and that very quickly gives way to a uh, a hoppy bitterness. Maybe just a hint of pine. Plenty of dankness, though. Plenty of plenty of dankness. Uh, surprisingly flavorful and surprisingly deep for a uh, what's classified as a lager. Yeah, classified as a lager. Um, so yeah, I would kind of qualify, quantify this as the the hopheads lager. The, 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 excuse me, the, the hops make a really solid push, and um, there aren't a, a ton of flavor notes going on, but I think for, for a lager, it's certainly one of the, the deepest in terms of flavor notes, or just kind of flavors in general, again. Dank hops, a little bit of pine, maybe a little bit of citrus in there too, but I'm I'm really surprised at how the the hops that have kind of taken over the uh, taken over this beer. Uh, really good stuff from um, from my three heads, Freddie D. Logger. I uh, wish I knew a little more about it, but um. But there you go. Really, really solid beer. Really solid beer. And so that is it for this edition of Poorly Reviewed Beer. Just as a bit of a programming note with uh, Christmas coming up in about a week and a half, 
Uh, I'll be up north my, at my parents. I doubt I will have uh, video video recording capability. So I'll probably be throwing in a couple of extra video reviews over the next week and a half to just kind of make up for the the week I will miss. And um, very special beer coming up this Sunday. Really excited. Really, really excited. It's going to be a lot of fun, the Sunday beer, the Sunday video review. Um, yeah, so that's it. I can find all my reviews, both video and written, along with news, commentary, and more at PoorlyReviewedBeer.com. You can also check me out on Twitter and Facebook. Those links will be in the description in the description below. Also find me on the mobile apps Untapped and Instagram under the username Poorly Reviewed Beer. And if you are so inclined, like this video and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you around at Poorly Reviewed Beer.